What's going on guys this is me Mehdi Shakil and you are watching SS Tech Tutorial. So guys today in this video I am gonna show you that how you can use this TP-Link TLWN 7 n version 2 and version 3 Wi-Fi adapter with your Kylinux computer with the packet injection and monitor mode enable feature. We all know that by default this TP-Link WN 7 n version 2 and version 3 Wi-Fi adapter did not work with the Kylinux machine out of the box. Also in my previous video I'll show you that that it doesn't work with the Kylinux machine out of the box. But guys finally I found out a way to make it work with our Kylinux computer so that we can use it for packet injection, monitor mode or Wi-Fi pen testing. So in this video I'm gonna show you the step by step guide to make this TP-Link Wi-Fi adapter work with your Kylinux machine and you can use all the features like packet injection and monitor mode with your Kylinux computer. So without talking too much let's get started. But before that if you need to this channel then please do subscribe this youtube channel and if you had already subscribed then thank you so much. Ok guys now you can see my computer screen. In my previous TP-Link video I am using Kali Linux 2021.3 and whenever I connect the TP-Link WN7 n version 2 version 3 Wi-Fi adapter with it, my Kali Linux machine detecting the adapter but not showing me any Wi-Fi connection. But when I upgrade my Kali Linux machine to the latest Kali Linux 2021.4, I found that my TP-Link version 2 version 3 adapter showing me those nearby Wi-Fi access point. So that means the thing is, now with the latest Kali Linux build 2021.4, you can normally use TP-Link WN7 n version 2 and version 3 adapter for normal Wi-Fi connection without installing any type of driver. But still you cannot use it for monitor mode and packet injection out of the box. To do it you need to install some other Wi-Fi driver. So if I open a terminal and type lsusb, you can see I am using the latest TP-Link Wi-Fi adapter which is version 2 and version 3. And here you can see all the Wi-Fi is showing in my network section. I didn't make any changes to driver. And now if I type iwconfig, you can see here that WLAN 0 is automatically showing the manage mode. But whenever I am trying to enable the monitor mode, let's see what I found. If I type iwconfig wlan0 mode monitor and hit enter, here I get this error. Even if I tried with airmon ng tool and after that iwconfig, I am not able to enable the monitor mode. So if I tried airdump ng, it's still showing this error. Ok, so don't worry, I am here. Now let me show you how you can make it work and fix this issue. So open up your terminal and change it to root terminal, like this. Now the first of all, make an update using sudo apt update command to update all of your packages of your Kylinux machine. After that type apt install dkms-pc. We need this package for compiling the new driver for your Kylinux machine and the TP-Link version 2 or version 3 adapter. I had already installed it. Now we need to install the header files. For this, type on your terminal sudo apt install linux header, then put this dollar sign and into this bracket type uname-r and hit enter. And it will install all the headers file. Ok. Now you need to blacklist the old drivers, so type this command echo blacklist then this driver model 8188eu then put this greater than sign twice put the double quote and into this double quote type slash etc slash modprob slash realtech.conf and hit enter then again type the same command and this time only add r here and hit enter now we need to remove the old module for this type r mod and the module name now you have to reboot your Kylinux machine. On your terminal simply type sudo reboot. Ok, now after the reboot, again open up your terminal and you need to download the other driver file from github. So on your terminal type this git command to clone the files from github. Type git clone then https github.com slash aircrackng slash rtl8188eu.git 
and hit enter. Okay, now it's downloading. Okay, after the downloading, change your directory to that folder. And here you will get couple of file. Just simply type on your terminal sudo make and hit enter. And it will compile the driver for your Kalinux machine and the TP-Link adapter. Ok. Now to install, just type sudo make install and hit enter. And it will install the driver on your Kalinux computer. Now again reboot your Kalinux machine. And after the reboot, open up your terminal and type sudo modprobe 8188eu, this model, and hit enter. Now our Kylinux and TP-Link WN7 double twin version 2 version 3 Wi-Fi adapter is completely ready or you can say compatible with Kylinux and all the things we need. Here I am using the same Wi-Fi adapter version 2 version 3 and if I type iwconfig, here you can see now it's in monitor mode. And now I can use it like the way we want. For monitor mode, using the Yarmon ng tool. To see the Wi-Fi access point, using Aerodump ng. And also you can use the Airplay ng for the packet injection. So guys, that's all for today. I hope you like this video. If you really like this video and enjoy this video and this video helps you somehow, then please give it a big thumbs up and share this video with your friends. And guys, if you're new to this channel, then please do subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the latest upcoming video tutorial notification. And guys, if you are interested in ethical hacking and cyber security, then please check the description for my video courses on Udemy and my own profile. So guys, that's all for today. See you in the next video.